welcome in rinse sampling we use a liquid like water or a cleaning solution to wash the equipment this liquid picks up any dirt residue or contaminants left behind we then collect this liquid and take it to the lab to check for any impurities swab sampling is like using a small cotton stick to wipe a specific area of the equipment or surface this swab picks up anything left behind like residue or contaminants after that we take swab sample to the lab and analyze it to see if there is anything like active ingredients detergents or even microbes still present majorly there are three steps for sampling by rinse method step 1 preparation select a suitable solvent prepare clean containers and ensure equipment is visually clean step 2 sampling rinse the surface with a measured solvent volume ensuring thorough coverage and collect the solution in a sterile container step 3 analysis test the sample using validated methods like hplc toc and compare the results with specifications as like rinse sampling swab sampling also done in three steps step 1 preparation select validated swabs and solvents and identify the swab area based on a risk based approach step 2 sampling swab the defined area using a systematic pattern ensuring consistent pressure and coverage transfer the swab to a clean container with solvent for extraction step 3 analysis extract and analyze the sample using appropriate methods example hplc uv and compare results with acceptance criteria now we will see some basic and important questions about rinse and swab sampling technique in pharma industry first question what are the commonly used swab sampling techniques simple swabbing rotational swabbing zigzag swabbing grid pattern swabbing directional swabbing pressure swabbing and wet dry swabbing are the commonly used swab sampling techniques in pharma industry what are the important components of swab sampling kit sterile swab sterile tubes or containers neutralizing agents buffer solutions labels sample collection instruction protective equipment and carrying case are the important components of swab sampling kit why is swab sampling preferred for critical surfaces swab sampling ensures direct collection of residues from small or product contact areas for precise analysis what is the main advantage of sampling by rinse method sampling by rinse method allows testing of large areas or complex equipment that cannot be easily accessed what is the purpose of rinse sampling rinse sampling is used to detect soluble contaminants in large equipment or inaccessible areas by analyzing the rinse solution what type of contaminants can rinse sampling detect rinse sampling is effective for detecting water soluble or easily solvent soluble contaminants such as detergents or residual actives last and very important question which guidelines are referred for rinse and swab sampling technique in pharmaceutical industry fda's guide to inspections of cleaning validation ich q7 good manufacturing practices ems guideline on health based limits who trs number 937 and pix guideline 0006-3 are the commonly referred guidelines for rinse and swab sampling technique in pharma industry Don't forget to like, comment and share. Subscribe to channel for more videos related to our pharmaceutical industry.